what's up welcome or welcome back to my channel thank you for clicking on this video today i'm doing another hair tutorial this is my ariana grande inspired 90s ponytail hairstyle it's a lot easier than i thought it was going to be and it's actually super cute so please don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe and if you'd like to see how to get this hairstyle then keep on watching first thing you're going to do is take any comb and you're going to part the front piece which is going to be the swoop so I think I'm going to do this side so you can see it better. So I'm just going to go from like my eyebrow arch upwards and just go about mm, an inch and a half I want to say. I have a very weird part so I'm just going to leave it like this for now and I think this is the side I want to do it on but I'm not sure yet. So once we have that part down I'm then going to take my comb this way and section off that front area. So, my hair is really long too, so I'm not wanting to take a lot in the front because I don't want to pin a lot back. So I'm just going to take about this much. This is what it looks like. And then I'm just going to take a bobby pin and secure that. And then what we're going to do is just put the rest of our hair in a ponytail. So I first will brush it out with just a hairbrush. Okay, and then once we have like the base, I'm just gonna use some hairspray on the ponytail. This is the uh, Mark Anthony Hydrating Coconut Oil Volume Hairspray. Oh. Just kidding, so my hairspray is actually empty, so I guess I have to use this. I do like using this, except it's just so harsh, like I have to wash my hair immediately after, otherwise it will stay in this hairstyle for days. So I'm just gonna use the Got To Be Glued Blasting Freeze Spray. And then I'm just gonna go in with my Boar Bristle Brush as well after I spray that. And I'm just gonna do little sections at a time just because I don't want the spray like drying on me. Okay, my hands are getting really sore, so I think that is tight enough. So I'm gonna take my first elastic and I'm just gonna put my hair in the ponytail. Um, I'm just gonna do it at the crown, of, a little above the crown of my head. So it's high ponytail. It does take me a few tries to do my ponytail. And I actually forgot that I have this L'Oreal Magic Root Cover Up instant root concealer spray in the shade light brown i got it to do like diy freckles but um never really used it so i sprayed it in the spots that i look like i'm balding so i don't know if it's the right color hopefully it works this was the area that was patchy okay but that's what that looks like and i'm gonna leave it like that now moving on to this front piece what i'm gonna do first is i'm just gonna brush it out give it a little spray and then brush that out and then I'm just going to try placing it. So this part might take some trial and error just to see where it sits best, what looks best. Again, you can just use hairspray for this. I would recommend hairspray instead of the got to be glued spray. Okay, so the placement looks good to me. So I'm just going to try bobby pinning it to see how it looks. I'm just gonna take my first initial bobby pin just behind, like directly behind my ear, so the hair will stay. I'm just gonna swoop it upwards and do another bobby pin right about here. And then I'm just going to use the remainder of that hair and wrap it around the ponytail. I was gonna do that anyway with like a piece, but I don't need to anymore because I have that hair, so then just one more bobby pin there. So I only used three bobby pins. I don't know how it looks from the back because I can't see, but I think it looks pretty secure. And then I'm just going to do another spritz of this. Just over it one more time. Just to really like secure that. And then I'm going to tease the back because I do want the ponytail to stand up a little higher. So just taking a little bit more of this spray. I'm just taking a few little pieces and then back combing with my comb. And then I'm just going to carefully brush out my ponytail. 
And you can add the little flick on the bottoms of your hair, but mine is a little long, so it looks kind of stupid in my personal opinion when I do it. But I've seen it on girls with long hair and it looks really cute, so it probably works, but I just don't like the look on my hair, so I'm just gonna leave it straight. Okay, so this is the ponytail all complete. I think it's super cute. I've never worn a hairstyle like this before, and I will definitely be wearing it out again in the future now that I know I can pull it off and it looks kind of cute. Actually, I don't know if I can pull it off, but I think that I'd be able to go out wearing it and it would look okay. So if you liked today's video, please don't forget to give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe and let me know down below if you have any other video recommendations for me and I will see you in my next video. Bye.